Hey boys, what's going on? We are back with another Madden 23 Ultimate Team video. And today, it's a slightly different type of video than you would normally see from me. We got an update on Zero Chill, which is coming tomorrow at noon Eastern Standard Time. A lot of cards, a lot to unravel. Um, I'm do my best to pick up everything. I don't have screenshots of everything, but I did pick up quite a few. So we'll get into that momentarily. But first, there was a huge announcement. Um, practice mode is coming to Mutt. So you can practice with different difficulties, X factors, abilities. So you can really like try out abilities kind of like versus the computer and like, or it's like mastering plays, stuff like that. So it could help if maybe you're, you're struggling against a certain defense. You could just practice against that defense or something like that. Or maybe your defense needs some help. You can just practice defense. There's a lot you can do with that to help um, own up on some skills before you go to head-to-head -to -head if you're struggling. So that's definitely a win for the community. Um, I know we wanted something like cross-platform or something like that, which would be incredible. But this is a step in them giving us some of the features that we want. So we'll take, take the little dubs that we can. Um, also, training variety packs will be back tomorrow. So we should see training prices potentially go up unless the cost of the training variety pack is more expensive which it probably will be more training because overalls went up so we'll see how kind of how how it looks tomorrow but you might be like oh the training doubled but remember training was like 10 to 12 coins and now it's like four and a half five coins so if the price doubled in training but training cost cut in half then it's like the same so just remember that when we do rip those at some point, um, there's LTDs. Um, there's like um, a red versus blue team where you can like pick up the players and stuff like that. I don't really have too much info on that, um, but let's get into it. So we're getting a zero chill field pass. I'm not on the screen anymore, so um, that's fine. You guys don't have to see my ugly mug, um, but we're going to get um, a field pass. Um, it's, so season two field pass is ending and then season three is delayed because it's just going to be a zero chill one up to level 50 for zero chill. Tons of rewards, tons of coins, tons of players, um, a lot, but they kind of revealed Deion Sanders you get at level 30. You get presents. If you guys don't know about the presents, we'll talk about that a lot more once we actually can get present packs and everything like that. Um, but we got Deion Sanders, um, which is pretty exciting. Um, I, he's not he's not the top tier receiver or anything like that, but 93 speed. I'll be able to get him up to 95 on my theme team. It's just it's a free card everybody gets, so we'll 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 take what we can get there. And then Adoree Jackson. So this is a raid boss. So there's gonna be raids going on where you uh where like the whole community like chips away. I don't know exactly. Because I mean it's like certain like whether it's like um Kind of, kind of like, um, like a head-to-head -head sort of thing. Um, I don't know if it's going to be more like um, a house rules. We'll kind of see exactly what it looks like. But if we win the raid, Adoree Jackson goes up to like, I think plus two overall. Um, so potential to get a nice Adoree Jackson corner on your team. Um, and that's something that's going to take a course of a while, and they're going to like update on how we're doing. Um, and it's not going to be like you just you you. Beat, beat him once like you gotta play it a, quite a few times um across the board then we'll take him down and get a good corner and now i know you guys see him donald parham 93 overall so there's gonna be like um a gridiron forge like we had last year where you get a player from um hitting a certain level in the solos or a certain amount of stars in the solos but we're going to get a 93 Donald Parham. It's not a player that you can get tomorrow. There's going to be three drops of this between now and I think the first week of January. Um, and he's not going to, you're not going to be able to get enough stars to obtain him until drop three. So we, we got something to look forward to or something to dread. Um, but 93 overall Donald Parham, six foot eight, the beast with a 91 speed. So he's looking pretty, pretty nasty. And now we're going to get into our LTDs here. So we're going to have LTD Dexter Lawrence, um, 83 speed. Doesn't You guys can see his stats here. And then we also are going to have LTD Mike Williams. Um, and there probably will be multiple LTD drops throughout um, Zero Chills. This is one of the biggest promos of the year. 
Um, but kind of some stats. Mike Williams is a taller receiver, so you're going to see tall receiver, good speed. That's kind of one of the things that they were kind of highlighting about him um, during the stream. And then we're getting into our first set of the champions. First, we're going to have 95 overall Adanian Tomlinson with 94 speed, 95 acceleration, 95 agility, or 94 agility, 91 carrying, 84 catching. 95 change of direction, 87 trucking, and 97 break tackle. There's one of these cards that is an absolute goon and I think is a must cop. This is not the one I'm talking about. But this is Sean Taylor is back in Mutt and he looks absolutely incredible. 94 speed, 94 acceleration, 90 tackling, 90 um, play rec. 90 Pursuit, 89 Man, 95 Zone, and 97 Hit Power. Absolutely nasty. Sean Taylor, he also um, gets a secondary position of strong safety. He's just an absolute beast. And then our other two that we get now, uh, TJ Watt, 95 overall with 91 speed, 93 Excel, 84 Strength, 94 Tackling, 91 Play Rec, 95 Block Shed, 91... Um, power move and 95 finesse and then our final is gonna be mike evans another taller wide receiver with 93 speed and they're all gonna get some nice ability buckets now well i'll get back on the screen because that's all the screenshots i have there is more um they did not go into all the sets or the store offers or training offers but uh, from looking at some of their screenshots that they did show, it does appear that there is going to be like a snowflake currency. So that's pretty standard. Um, there's also going to be um, what they were calling stocking stuffers. We got that last year. They're not all being dropped at once, but there's going to be a 92 overall for every team. You're going there's like some like an Alan Lazard, an Xavier McKinney. There's a bunch of other players. I think we're getting. I want to say eight of them right now, and then you'll be able to get more throughout the promo. There's also out of positions, which if you guys aren't aware, out of position is a player that they're giving like a different position to. So um, there's a Raven out of position, Daniel Faalalele. I think I said that right. Um, he's um, like a back backup offensive line, but they're giving him a running back position. Some of the more famous ones, like that wide receiver, Dion. There's been quarterback, Derrick Henry, free safety, Calvin Johnson. So there's going to be quite a few of them. Um, and this is just drop one of four zero chill releases. So there's going to be a lot more content coming. A new field pass. I might have forgotten something. Um, I kind of just watched the stream and jumped on here. And if I did, I do greatly apologize. But I just wanted to kind of update you guys as the stuff that's coming out. We're about 12, 16 hours away from Zero Chill dropping, assuming it drops on time. Um, and I will hopefully get a Zero Chill pack opening video to you guys shortly after it becomes live. So, boys, with that being said, that is all I got for today. Thank you for checking out the video. I appreciate it. I love you. Stay safe and I'll see you all real soon.